welcome back to World of Warship and let's talk ships. I'm Zera and I'm the one who's providing the fastest information about what's next. And oh boy, oh boy, I will hype you like crazy. Keep that in mind before I gonna say everything that still work in progress. But remember for a couple of the patches ago that we're gaming decide to uh, split the Russian line same thing goes here with the US line uh, that I will talk about everything I would like to say about the new change and I still believe that probably in the best case I have no idea 100% when it's gonna be the change but probably before Christmas that will be just awesome now okay on to tier, tier 5 Omaha, nothing it will be changed, but the big change is Pensacola will be a tier 6 uh, uh, cruiser which is in the main line. There's an alternative uh, line from US Dallas all the way to the Worcest. I do apologize if I voucher uh, it, but anyhow, anyhow, this is the second Split the first split in the US cruiser line, and I'm so hyped of two reasons, guys. We will receive not one but one, two, three, four, five new US cruisers. How awesome is not that? Absolutely hilarious, guys. And <clears throat> I know, guys, that for probably I, I'm not saying too much, but probably I will take a closer look of the buffalo buffalo it's absolutely amazing and uh, before i'm gonna say too much guys i urge you at least to come to the tier 9 and also explain why now even if you own a uh, Des Moines it does not mean that you will automatically receive all the um, the other lines so keep that in mind now I'm very, very, very uh, hype about this, and this is for me, Zera Channel, a cruiser captain, and of course a destroyer captain as well. But it's a big change. I still believe this this news that I put a video for many, many months ago. It's finally close, guys. The new alternative branch, and how weird is that? The Cleveland will be a tier eight cruiser. <laughs> Absolutely hilarious all right so uh before we're gonna do just just do it tier uh six pensacola tier uh, seven new orleans tier eight baltimore tier nine buffalo and tier 10 uh, des moines it's for the main uh line i still believe nothing gonna be changed in the AA or your consumable. However, for the split line, I'll bet 100 bucks that the Wargaming will decide to give additional uh, consumable that you and me don't have it. How do I know it? Because remember, guys, in the uh, Japanese, but also, yes, the Japanese destroy line, but also for the Russian, uh, Russian uh, split line, they had two different consumable from tier 9 and 10 but i still believe that from tier 8 all the way to tier 10 the alternative line will have a new goddamn consumable that we don't know yet but i'll bet 100 bucks that it will be so so what we do have at tier 6 us dallas absolutely hilarious tier 7 us helena and Cleveland, <laughs> my beloved Cleveland, tier 8 and tier 9 US Seattle and the tier 10 Worcester. Wor oh, I, I apologize if I announce. Now from United States and this is probably why I'm so hype. Many of you will grind this line. That's a damn thing. And I have bad news for all aircraft carrier captain. You will be screwed even more in the next um, future. Why? Because I still believe, I personally believe that uh, all um, US line, cruiser line, will be very, very 
very good, even the new ones. I'll bet the Bo uh, Des Moines and the second tier 10 cruiser will wreck everything and everyone in AA department. And that's a goddamn guaranteed. So, my uh, suggested to you, when this line it's, uh, it's, it's alive, you as a uh, aircraft carrier captain, I'm just saying good luck. Put your uh, aircraft carrier in the port and have us as a decoration. Because a lot of uh, players, especially in the United States, will try to grind this line. So, what's next? I'll also show you guys... Um, uh, yeah, it's basically exactly what, I, what I'm saying right now. Now, some pictures, not a whole lot to be honest with you. They are kind of a funky work in progress. Uh, n not so much uh, but uh, I still believe at the Buffalo I will try to show you some real pictures so guys uh, not a whole lot to, to say about but uh, it's it's a very weighted long about this change and I still believe many of you guys who love being a cruiser captain this is a great news and I very much would like to know what is the goddamn flavor for the alternative land before just I know I do know there will be a radar and they will have a good AA but beside that I still believe they were giving me still working on additional flavor yes and a consumable that we don't know yet that would be very interesting to see what's all about guys that's all i like to say for now subscribe to my channel and in the next uh, patch i will talk about which um, cruiser you need to have right now in the port before this uh, cru new cruiser line will hit the live version to benefit because I <clears throat> I believe that let's say um, if you own a Baltimore you probably should also uh, earn uh, uh, Cleveland but the th problem is and I still believe it's a, a big problem where gaming will never give you any tier 9 for free even if you own uh, Des Moines, I still believe you still have to unlock it because the tier 9 both in both um, um, How should I say in the both? Um, uh, grinds are brand new which basically means that if you own today a Baltimore You will never receive US Seattle or Buffalo for free. That's the thing I still believe it's so because I remember guys how I know it I remember that I um, own uh, Trashkent and Udaloy and I receive the 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 new Udaloy and the new Trashkent uh, uh, for free however on the Akizuki line remember the Akizuki well it does not matter if you will reach the Shimakaze you will never receive the Akizuki for free so some brand new uh, ships especially for an alternative line you still need to grind but I still believe it's one hell of a nice grind you still st gonna start at tier 6 that's all I like to say for now guys subscribe to my channel and leave me your comment below what you think about all this new split line for the US cruiser line thank you guys for watching and always captains fair seas and goodbye